Hi, this is Ed from Exotic Blanks. As many of you know, Dawn and I did craft shows before we started Exotic Blanks. And when we did the craft shows, we were fortunate to be able to use pens that were uh, the Junior Series <clears throat> and the Junior Emperor. Generally, a variety of pens that were all somewhat interchangeable. Over the years, this seems to have changed. Most of the pens these days are not interchangeable in their, in their innards. So what we are doing is working with Deacom to try to bring back that concept of interchangeability. Today I'd like to show you a couple of things that we've succeeded in. <clears throat> First, this is uh, our Junior George pen. Again, it's made by Deacom. And in this particular case, this one has got um, desert ironwood that I turned last night. So as you can see, it makes a pretty pen, and it, this, this particular one is in uh, gold titanium. So what we used to be able to do was to have the pen available as a rollerball, and then if people came up and wanted to buy something and chose or wanted to choose a fountain pen, we were fortunate that all of the different front ends interchanged with each other. Well, that is no longer the case. At least it's not the case for most of the pens that are out there now. So what we're attempting to do with the ACOM is go back to the future, so to speak, and try to find a way <clears throat> so that you can take this rollerball, take that front end off, and instead put on the standard number five fountain pen front end. And you'll notice that it screws on perfectly. The threading matches. Everything is the way it should be. But that's only half the story. This, of course, will go into here and everything fits as it should. However, the other half of the story is suppose they want a larger nib, the number six nib, as we call it. In order to do that, we have also gotten from Deacom a number of nibs that are the number six nib, the larger nib size. And that also, as you can see, threads in perfectly because the threads are all the same. And it goes into the cap perfectly. Everything works the way that it's supposed to. So it gives you the ability to change out your front end on the fly. As time progresses here, we hope to be able to offer, these are Deacom nibs, which are made by one of the German manufacturers. We are not 100% sure who it is, so I'm just saying that it's one of the German manufacturers. They do not have a stamping of Deacom on them. They are actually left blank, so there is nothing that gives an identification that your customer may object to. It also is designed so it will take either the converter so that they can use um, bottle ink, or it will also take a cartridge. So. If you want to, you can sell this pen as a convertible pen, or you can change it on the fly if your customer says, gee, I would buy that if it was a fountain pen. You no longer have a problem with the threading not working. All those front ends will work on our new Junior George line. There's more pens to come, there's more nibs to come, but we're just letting you know now that uh, this has been under development for some months and we will now have it available in many different platings. We're working on antique silver, antique brass, of course, Thai gold, black titanium, chrome, and probably rhodium. So there will be a number of different possibilities. Those of you who are doing kitless may want to consider putting together your front ends to match that threading, and then you too can take the same benefits that we're going to be giving to all of our kit customers who use the Junior George or other members of the Junior family that are out now or will be introduced in the next couple of months. So that's where we're headed.
and that's what the pens will look like. Thank you for watching. This is Ed from Exotic Blanks. Good turning to you. Bye now.